Mighty slick. Mighty slick, I tell you. What? Oh. There you go. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Years ago, on my first Christmas Eve run, I was up on the roof making my rounds when I slipped on the ice myself. I reached out for a hand iron, but it broke off. I slid and fell. And yet, I did not fall off this train. Someone saved you? Or something. An angel. Maybe. Wait. Wait. W well, what did he look like? Did you see him? No, sir. But sometimes seeing is believing. And sometimes the most real things in the world are the things we can't see. The forsaken and the abandoned. Mind your steps now. These these board toys have suffered enough. Being left to rust and decay in the back alleys and vacant lots of the world. What are they doing here? It's a new concept the boss came up with. Instead of being thrown away, they're collected, refurbished. He calls it uh re-bicycling, something like that. Makes me want to cry. Seeing toys that were treated this way? These hopelessly entangled string puppets, marionettes, pose a particular problem. We found that the nimble fingers of our workforce here at the North Pole are best suited for working out those knots entangled. Oh, thank you. Uh oh, double lock. <laughs> You are just like me, my friend. A Scrooge! Ebony! Scrooge! North Pole! Santa Claus! This train! It's all a bunch of humbug! A bout of indigestion! Oh yeah, I know what you are! You're a doubter! A doubter! You don't believe! Hey, you missed it. We rode down some really sharp hills, and then we were on what looked like a frozen lake, but I know it was just an optical illusion caused by moonlight and atmosphere. He said the train was actually on the ice, but I said that was impossible, because you can't put a train track... Hey, where are you going now? 